Hello my friends. We have made it to Louisiana. This is part of the South that I have never been to, nor has Pat. So it's been really exciting. We found a place to stay close by New Orleans, maybe about 45 minutes away. Went on this crazy long bridge. It took almost a half of an hour just to get across it. And it really kind of scared some of our kids, but it was fun. There's a toll to go on this bridge, but personally, I think it might be worth it to at least experience it once. On our first day, we spent driving down a road that takes you by a lot of the really old plantations. So that was really neat to see that history and just the beauty of the homes. In the city of New Orleans, you must go visit the French quarters. It is so rich in history. It has been something I've always wanted to see and explore. New Orleans is an expensive city. Expensive but fun. Hey, look at you girl, buddy. Yeah. Look at okay. you girl. <laughs> you ready? One, very good. Two. Two. The kids had a lot of fun having beads thrown at them and they all got to pick a color and this girl was really, really sweet. And of course for breakfast we had to stop and get beignets. Since this was a bucket list destination for our family, we did splurge a little bit and do a horse-drawn carriage. We were the only ones on this buggy and our tour guide was amazing. He took a lot of pride in the history of the French quarters in New Orleans and he really loved his job, you could tell. That's the fresh material that was built for the priest, but they never use it yet. Now it's used for Hurricane Katrina Museum and the Mardi Gras Museum. Okay. Sounds you, like he's done a lot of movies in this area. Yeah, he has. He also built 30 homes of people that lost their houses during Hurricane Katrina. Well, that is all for this destination stop. I hope you enjoyed and until next time, we'll see you then. Take care. Bye.